sometimes after a successful weasel hunt, you just want to punch somebody in their darn face! A man in Washington last week burst into an apartment door carrying a dead weasel. The man within the apartment said, why are you carrying a weasel? To which the man replied, it's not a weasel, it's a Martin. Punch. He punched the man in the nose and ran away. He was later caught and arrested. But what I love about this story is not just that he was carrying a weasel. We could speculate over why he was carrying a weasel. Maybe he was famished and he was gonna eat it later. But what I really like is that he thought it was important to make the distinction between weasel and marten. A marten is in the weasel family, but apparently that wasn't specific enough for this guy. And he punched the other guy in the face. I wonder, does this guy get really pissed off when someone misidentifies a species? Was he originally going to be cordial, but then the weasel question set him off? We'll probably always wonder how the story would have played out if the man had just asked the correct question. Why are you holding a Martin? Uh-oh. Sounds like we have some breaking news from our live correspondent, Muncie Puterschmidt. Muncie, what's going on? Hi, Jacob. I'm standing in the backyard of a random person that I've never met before, and it looks like at one point they owned a dog. And the reason I know that is because just moments ago, I stepped on a turd. Okay, is that it? No, that is not all. I, hold on. I've, I've, I've just lodged the turd from my shoe, and I plan to eat no, it no, no, no. and tell our audience what it tastes like. No, I don't think that's a good idea, Muncie. I, I think it's important that the audience knows what this poop tastes like. I imagine no, it'll please, taste not put like some mouth. sort we of a, a bio, uh, Muncie, a bio I do not byproduct, put that poop in your mouth. you know, put a biological uh, stew. Don't even touch it. Get it away anyway, from your face. Anyway, no, here I go. It, oh, my God. Oh, my God, it's horrible. Oh. I can barely, I don't know if I can swallow it. I don't know if I, I did, I swallowed it. Oh, it's terrible. Let me, oh my God, oh, it doesn't get any better. I thought the next bite might be better, but it wasn't. What did you expect it to uh, taste like? It's poop. This is really horrible. Uh, why did I do this? I want to die. It, it tastes it tastes like it's drying my mouth out. It's rather moist, but it's still drying my mouth out. I don't understand why. Quit oh. it! Just stop swallowing oh, no. the poop. Don't, don't oh, swallow. No. Muncie, oh, God, God, why are you still swallowing the poop? This is just horrible. Stop it. Why did I do this? Well, I finished it. I finished the poop. Oh, my fingers are dirty. Wow, that was horrible. Sorry about that, everybody. Our uh, live correspondent, Muncie Pewterschmidt, is, is new. You'll just have to excuse him. Last week, I asked, what did this man spit on police officers after his arrest? And the answer was his own feces. As for this week, guess what they found in this man's butt after his arrest? Leave your funny guess as a comment, and if it makes me laugh, I will put it in next week's video with a link to your channel. It's like free publicity for you. Although, Admittedly, not that much publicity, but still. This has been The Random Report. I'm Jacob. I hope you enjoyed it. Adios.